I was in the Army, so came in in uh, July 2008 was when I came on active duty in the infantry. So, and then assigned to the 101st and uh, deployed to uh, near Kandahar, Afghanistan. It was a uh, tough thing, but you know, between family, friends, Wounded Warrior, and everyone else, we were able to uh, to keep moving forward. And I had much more support than I really needed, and it was very helpful. It was great because you get to see other people who've had injuries, whether they're similar or not, who've managed to recover, and life is good, and everything else. So it's just a uh, it's a good situation, knowing there are other people out there you can talk to and everything else. And without Wounded Warrior, it, it would have just been a tougher transition. I, I know I've, I've made so many really close friends and stuff like that that I travel and see and, and that kind of thing. And Wounded Warrior gives you people to fall back on that you can call when you're having a tough day or anything else. And you know, sometimes that's people in the Wounded Warrior staff or just other Wounded Warriors you've met along the way. So it's a, it's a combination of both. I think that they're just always willing to give you the support you need, you know, whether it's something to go do, or, or whatever else, and they, they've let me travel to so many places. I got to go back to Germany and thank the people there who care for us medically and everything else. You know, we're also able to see some of the wounded guys who are there and give them encouragement. So I think it just, they're very good about bringing all of us together so we can help each other along the way.